Next is a morning walk conversation with His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on April 24th, 1976 in Yes, trying to seek out. <laughs> no, that answer is there. Marching. With the Supreme. But again, they must come back there. That's not complete liberation. That means not complete knowledge. So they've also stopped. Ended in Dhamma. Practically, Srila Prabhupada, hmm. we see that we're dealing mostly with karmis, not with jnanis, in our preaching. Yeah. They're simply interested in some immediate for me satisfaction. Not. Vikarmi. For me, Vikarmi of course. We are dealing with Vikarmi. Vikarmi. Huh. Prohibited action. Yes. You know, Karmi will not do anything sinful. So why do we call them karmi? Vikarmi, opposite karmi. There's practically no karmi. Sinful. Sinful actions. Duskriti. Therefore, they will be punished in different forms of life. Therefore, you find so many species of forms of life. This is punishment. But Maya has started that thinking we are happy. This is like this tree is a punishment, but it has no sense. So this is punishment. He is happy. happy. Standing happily for 5,000 years. Making <laughs> <laughs> only water. <laughs> you are asked to stand here for five years, five hours. We'll feel most uncomfortable. Mm. But they are standing for five thousand years. No uncomfortable. This is punishment. Punishment is there, but unaware. For everyone is like Anyone in the material world is being punished in different degrees, but unaware. That is Maya's grace. That although he is punished, he cannot understand. <coughs> so they, they answer that if it's they're happy, then what's wrong with that? Yeah, that class you are, yeah. You're gone with that happiness. But we are not satisfied. You are asking, we are happy in that. But we are not. They can, they that is the divine weight in even. Happiness to the fool. Yeah. But sometimes they say that pain is part of life. Yeah, they let, let them say it. Because they will have to suffer. Unless they think like that, how they will suffer? How about on the hellish planets? Do they know the suffering there? In fact, <coughs> to an animal, 
whipping. It's nothing. And for a man to show the whip is a bit of So there are different degrees of consciousness. Even a child feels the upright by seeing the whip. As the animal actually being whipped. That is the difference. Shastra or the Shastra? <coughs> shastra, yes. there is no question of Shastra. It is Shastra. When there is no Shastra, there must be Shastra. Argumentum Bakulam. When there is no logic, give him weight. All this, they are awaiting, weeping. They are being whipped. How can we make them understand they are being punished? You can understand provided you have got the sense. If you are nonsense, you cannot understand. So if everybody you cannot understand means you are nonsense. Mm. That is the difference between sense and nonsense. That I already given the example. The same way to the animal, it is no suffering. But for a man, simply by seeing it is suffering. Mm. It is a question of sense. That is the difference between man and animal. The animal cannot understand that he is suffering. The man can understand. That is different. If you do not understand, then you are an animal. Now here it is clearly said, Janam is to Janabhadi Dukha Dushanu Darsana. This is unhappiness. And if you think, oh, is there unhappiness in dying? Then you are an animal. The animal has taken to the slaughter house. He is not disturbed. He is eating grass very peacefully. That is the animal life. If you do not understand what is unhappiness, then you are an animal. You are not human. But his unhappiness is a fact to remain in a tight bag for ten months, if you have no sense, oh, what is it? And still being killed, is it not unhappiness? And if you say, where is unhappiness? Then you are a stone. <coughs> Bhagavad Gita says, Janma is Janma is unhappiness. First of all, you have to remain ten months in a packed up bag, and that also risk your mother will kill you. And still you say, it is not unhappiness, then what is happiness? You are so dull that you see there, there is no unhappiness in birth. Practically you see. <coughs> they, they're so nonsense, they say, well, I can't remember. But they say something. animal. Nonsense means animal. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. They think we're funny, they say they're funny. The difference between animal and Therefore, if one is not spiritually advanced or has no spiritual sense, he is animal. He is not human. Saiva Gokhara. The verdict is already there. Saiva Gokhara. 
He is nothing, no better than the cows and asses. Often the, the devotee thinks that he's more unhappy than the kamis because he knows he's unhappy. And that means he's not a devotee. He's not a devotee. Yeah. He's not devotee. Devotee means the first time will be happy. Brahma Bhuta Prasanna Atma. If he's not Prasanna Atma, he's a rascal. <laughs> he, has, he has not entered his devotional life. <clears throat> he's outside. That is the test. That's why Guru Maharaj, when he saw Vishnu said, Everything is all right. Don't worry. in Kitab. That is it. And if he is still in want or unhappiness, that means he has no spiritual life at all. He is simply making a show. <laughs> <laughs>